Welcome back ladies and gentlemen. Today I'm going to be showing you the final part of my Grand Peony and Pop videos. This is number four I think. And as you can see, a beautiful flower on there. Absolutely gorgeous. And it smells divine. I should have really done this earlier on in the season but it'll be fine. First of all, you want to get your two canes, bamboo stings I use. Smooth metal ones if you've got them or plastic ones into the pot, one at one side, take the other one, put it opposite, you want, don't want to go through the uh, the roots, if you can avoid it, so get the side of the pot like that, like so, I also use this from the pound shop, it's a little plastic covered metal wire, great for anything like this, cut it off like so, it's so easy. You don't want it too tight, that's why I put two canes in. When you're having two canes in, you can put a nice bow around it without it putting too much pressure onto the uh, main stem. Right, and then take your plant, not like so, and round like that, and then round again to get the flower. There you go. If I had more flowers on this, what I would do is I would have the... Uh, if I had more flowers on this, I would probably have three canes in this pot and then wrap it round three canes so it keeps it like a cage inside. Yeah, very happy with that. It's up right now. You can see it, you can smell it. it looks divine. Let's get that out there. Yeah. Once you put the killer on, just make sure you, none of your leaves are catching. Like I said, the earlier you do this, the better, really. But I've got it just in time. And uh, yeah, if you've got any questions, don't hesitate to If you like my videos, please subscribe, folks. And remember, folks, happy sowing, happy growing. Oh, yeah, and by the way, this is a uh, Green Pinion Pots. Video number four. Thank you very much, folks. Thank you. Bye.